Today we're going to demonstrate how to use the Gempler's Rust Converter. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take all the, the loose rust, uh, any other dirt, uh, off this pick head axe. That's going to be our, our project for the day. Alright, so we have our pickaxe head cleaned up, uh, all the loose rust is off there. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put on some uh, nitrile gloves. You don't want to get your skin in contact with the rust converter. I'm going to shake this well. I'm going to pour into a separate container. I shouldn't need too much. I shouldn't need the whole bottle of this. We're just going to get half inch in the bottom of this can. Old paintbrush and we're going to put the first coat on here. And this should be dry uh, presumably in 20 minutes. So put it on freely. Don't be shy. Okay, as you can see, we've waited uh, about 20 minutes for this, and, and the pickaxe head is actually turning into a, uh, almost a black color, uh, and there's a little hint of blue. If you look closely, you can see the blue in there, uh, but now we're ready for our second coat. So I still have the converter in the can, and now we're going to apply a second coat. As you can see, uh, this pickaxe head is, is completely black after the second coat. Uh, looks really good. Uh, it's, basically, it's basically primed and ready for painting. So what we're going to do is we're going to use a best uh, to use an oil-based paint. And we're going to go ahead and paint this right over the rust converter. 